The Blessed Virgin Mary is a model for mothers. And we see this in all the events of her life and the events in the life of our Lord Jesus Christ. At the Annunciation, she accepted the will of God and she teaches mothers that they must always be ready to accept the will of God. She visited her cousin Elizabeth and this is a quality that mothers must have to care for others, especially those who are in difficulty. Elizabeth was an old woman. She needed the help of Mary. During her pregnancy, the Blessed Virgin Mary carried Jesus in her womb. She became a custodian of life. This is an example for mothers. Mothers are custodians of life. The womb of a woman is not the tomb. So a woman is the best person to preserve life, as the Blessed Virgin Mary did. She delivered Jesus even before her delivery. She, they were looking for a place, and there was no place for them in the inn. She suffered. She suffered poverty. She suffered difficulties in many ways. And as an example for mothers, especially mothers that have large families and difficult homes, that they must learn patience and endurance from the Blessed Virgin Mary. The Blessed Virgin Mary took the child Jesus and ran to Egypt when Herod was threatening. You still see the preservation of life by a mother, an example for mothers to always preserve life. The Blessed Virgin Mary accompanied Jesus in all her life. When Jesus got lost, she cared, looking for the child Jesus. That's how mothers care for their children. Finally, the Blessed Virgin Mary accompanied Jesus to Calvary. Mothers always accompany their children. Wherever the mother is, there is the child. So mothers should always call upon her for her intercession and help.